finished. Now, believe it or not, I've actually carried out lots of chemical reactions. Come with me. These shampoos, conditioners, bubble baths, in fact, all of these toiletries are made out of chemicals. Now, they may be acidic, neutral or alkaline. What I want to investigate is how you can tell which are which and why it should matter. I've come to see Patrick Love. He's in charge of developing new toiletries for Britain's biggest chemist. So why does it matter if a soap or toothpaste is an acid or alkaline? Well, your body is made up of a lot of different chemicals. Some of them are acidic, some of them are alkaline, some are neutral. And so it's important that the products uh, don't react in the wrong way with the chemicals in your body. Right, but how can you tell then if something is either an acid or alkaline? Do you just guess? Well, no, we don't actually. We've got something called universal indicator paper and it comes in these little packs here. Um, and this changes colour depending on how acid or how alkaline whatever it is, is. We've got some uh, ordinary cola here, and if I dip this in, what do you can see there? Ah, uh, now that's gone quite pinkish, sort of orangey colour. Here I've got a table that shows the range that you can go through, and it goes through from red, which is uh, acid, through to the blue. So that must be an acid? That is right, that's right. an acid. So an acid will turn to, towards the orange or the red colour. And here I've got some uh, ordinary household bleach. And then if we test this again, what do you see there? Wow, now that's very blue, greenish. So that's a, an alkaline. Alkaline. Right. So can we do some more testing? We certainly can. I've got a nice one for you. OK. Uh, perhaps you'd like to just uh, test your saliva. Mm. <laughs> so uh, I'll tell you what, if you'd like to put a little bit of uh, saliva in, uh, okay. in there, then... Right. Uh, Let's see what we get now. Uh, there we are. That's now, green. You see there? That's very slightly green. What that shows is yeah. slightly alkaline. Good match. Yeah. Why don't have a bite of one of those oranges and get a nice, li nice bit of orange juice in your in your mouth? Okay. Tough job, but someone's got to do it. Mmm. Very juicy. Now, if you uh, have another spit, if you don't mind, in there. Right. Excuse me. <laughs> okay. Right, so how's that gone? Uh, slightly orange. Yes, that's right. So that's on the acid side, OK? And when the citric acid gets in your mouth, it turns it to acid. Right. Now, there are other acids that uh, hang around in your mouth, and although the saliva can neutralise these acids, some it can't, and that's why it's important to brush your teeth. So it looks like I'm going to have to watch the acidity in my mouth and carry on spitting.